Hey everyone, it's Blakeberry. Welcome to part two of Memorial Day. And this is the hall part. So let's get right into it. The first, first, the first store we went to was, that I bought something at was Bloomies. Hello, little brown bag. This was the dress if you watched part one. And it's actually not a dress. It's a v-neck, simple v-neck, alternative apparel. Nice, it's pretty deep V actually. You see? Like it'll go down to like if this were here, like whoop, there it is. Whoop, there it is. Mm, mm, mm. So that was that. It was originally twenty four dollars. Like twenty five. I don't know. Twenty five. I got it for eight. Boom. So that was that. That was the only thing I got there. And then what shall I do next? Then I went to Century 21, C21, what up? And I've been wanting a new, okay, so when I sleep, I don't use a flat sheet, like the sheet in between, like that goes on top of you and then the comforter. I don't sleep with that because I toss and turn way too much. It's always on top, it's a bitch. So instead I just bought a fitted sheet and look at what I got, boom. It's this nice gray, pattern like I didn't know it was gonna be a pattern it's kind of like a tie-dye but it turned out to be a pattern and I'm okay with it it's a 600 thread count hotel Gramercy luxury collection mm. and it was originally $30 I got it for $8.99 so boom. boom so then the next place we went to was necessary clothing and it's a female store but I was there with Stephanie we were shopping and I found some sunglasses let me take them out five dollars ready can you can you handle this it's like a nice brown um, polarized lens with UV protection and I will put them on I will model them for you if I could edit I would insert ding 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 like Boom, photo shoot, Tamar Braxton. So that was that. I was very thrilled. Had a pair of Ray-Bans. They were silk with the silver, um, what is it? Like cover, like gloss on the lens. And they broke and I was devastated. But whatever. And then, what else? Oh wait, I didn't even finish my Century 21 stuff. I got the sheet from Century 21. I also just literally sent my mom an email, or my mom and my aunt an email saying, oh my god, I found a birthday gift for me, like, because I never know what to ask for, and I found something, but guess what? I literally had to buy it, because at Century 21, it was $19. So this is a George Foreman grill, not a knockoff, like a real George Foreman. It's small, perfect for me, perfect for my small apartment, and I don't like to cook on a skill, uh, skillet or a... Like a sauce, no, not a frying pan, but like a, god, what is that called? Mm, a pan, non-stick, skillet, there we go. And that can just be like annoying in my small kitchen, like, ugh, it's just a pain in the ass. So, I wanted this, keeps my portion controls down, like, it would fit like one good sized chicken breast, maybe two small pork chops two small burgers, a couple sausage links, like Italian sausage, not like breakfast sausage, like sausage to like put in a meat sauce or something. Yummy. And then what else? I got one more thing from that. Oh, so I also got something for my like second family dad. Um, I go to my friends during holidays most of the time. Um, unless I go to like my home home but on times when I can't like travel that far I go to my friend Nicole's and her family is always so gracious and humble and they're basically my second family in the city so I got the dad this barbecue grill set mm -hmm. and it's a Budweiser honey regular smoked barbecue with this nice silicone Budweiser branded brush and I thought that was a great gift because he's a great barbecuer and there's this one thing he makes it's like I think it's mm, spare rib or like a pork 
maybe it's just ribs, like ribs, pork ribs, whatever, and he puts this glaze or something on it, literally, I remember it, end of last summer, mmm, I'm salivating, it's so good, so I got that for the dad, and then continuing on, done with Century 21, liquor store time, I got the mom her favorite wine, Cavit, imported from Italy, nice, I don't like this, I've tried it, and she loves it, so she can drink it, whole bottle to her, yay, and then last but not least, I went to my favorite store, and I bought something, mmm, you can't get with Michael Kors if you went with Michael Kors. Yes, that was Nicki Minaj rapping just then. Boom. So, I went to Michael Kors. We were in Soho. I was walking with Stephanie. I was like, ah, let's go to Michael Kors. Maybe I'll buy something. I ended up buying something. So, here it is. Oh my god, I don't want to unwrap it. I'm unwrapping it on camera. This nice Michael Kors sticker. It's nice and wrapped. And JP, that's all I'm saying. You will appreciate this. I know you're like oogling as to what this could be. So, but I don't want to rip it. I'm not going to rip it. I'm going to pull it out on the sides. I don't want to rip the sticker. Ooh. Ah, so nice. So nice. I'm not taking this off yet, the sticker. Um, this is the tan. Hold on. The large cosmetics case in vanilla, and oh my god, so nice! Oh my god, I almost no, I wouldn't have actually purchased a five hundred dollar bag, but there was this amazing duffel. I literally walked in and went, <gasps> and the girl saw me, and she goes, she points, she goes, the duffel. True story, Stephanie can vouch. And I was like, yes. So they, oh my god, it was amazing. They emptied out the bag, I like tried it on, I like, oh my god, that bag. Mmm. Just like, do you, do you have like a product that you're just like, yes, like, that is everything. That is that bag, that duffel bag, that Michael Kors duffel bag. Oh god, so good. But this is the, I settled for the large cosmetics case. I didn't settle. I mean, I'll get that one day, but this is what I got for today. And it's so nice. Oh my gosh. And it's actually not that big because I won't be putting my cosmetics because I have too many. Um, but it's got a nice zip closure. I didn't even open it yet. Um, I guess I'll do that now. Oh, it's so nice. Oh, it's like that. You know, like, got the pocket. And then this is my cores. And I'm not going to price drop on this because that's not necessary, but, oh my god, literally, it's just, oh, it just feels so good. And, like, I travel, especially now that it's summer, I travel a lot on the weekend, so, like, just to put a couple things in here overnight, boom, in the bag. Perfect. So, that was my treat yourself gift, and, you know what? It's Memorial Day. Thank you to everyone who has served our country. Thank you to America for being American, and... You know what? Treat yourself on Memorial Day. There's lots of sales. Go out, do a little shopping, get some new work clothes, get some new gym clothes, get some new something for you. And that's what I did with this. I said, you know what? I'm getting it. It's a treat myself. So that is my Memorial Day haul. And like I said, I apparently only shop in holiday times. So I don't know when I'm going to have another shopping haul. So this is the video for now. Thank you for watching. Have a great Memorial Day. Yay, America, red, white, blue.